Welcome gamers, Hazador here, and today I'm bringing you another episode of Double Trouble. In this episode I'm going over Andre Schuller and Bellarabi. I put these two in this 4-3-2-1 formation and they played pretty well for me. Now first let's go over Andre Schuller. This guy was very very impressive, as you can see he got 27 goals in 31 games. Now that's pretty incredible isn't it, considering he's a wide player, to get that amount of goals for me is pretty pretty good. He didn't get that much assists, but you know, with those amount of goals you can't really complain what he's done. If he gets the goals, I don't really care if he doesn't get assists, as long as he's contributing to the team and doing a lot for me. He's got 4 star 4 star, which comes into play very very well, and he's just an all round great player to play with. He's so so enjoyable to have on the ball, he's very very quick, he's great at dribbling, his shooting is actually really really incredible. I was very surprised at his shooting, it is quite high at 80 for a winger, if you try this guy out, trust me, his shooting is on point. He's actually quite strong as well, he very rarely got barged off the ball, and that's what made him get so much goals for me. He was so strong, he was so so quick, and he just couldn't really beat him. He either whips a cross in, goes for a shot, wins a penalty, he always does something for the team, and I definitely recommend going out and buying this guy. He is 7k, which is a little bit pricey, but you're really really getting your money's worth here. This guy is an absolute beast. His work rates aren't the best, but to be honest, he was always in position for me. They are medium medium, but it seems like he's playing on high low, because he's always up the pitch whenever you need him. Counter attacks, if you're playing possession football, no matter what you do, he's always in position on the left wing or left forward in this case waiting for the ball. This guy is such a good player man, you should definitely go and try him. I'm not too sure if he'd perform the same at left wing because you know I'm playing him at left forward and this is kind of more of a striker position than a winger but at left forward he absolutely bosses it. Now moving on to right forward we have Bellarabi and to be honest this guy disappointed me man. Compared to Andre Schuller this guy was bad. He got 9 goals in 31 games and managed 11 assists. 9 goals compared to 27 goals. I don't really need to tell you do I? That is such a big difference. He didn't even get that much assists for me either. I think he got about 4 more assists than Schuller, which isn't as good. It's just not good enough is it? He's also more expensive than Andre Schuller, so you're paying more for less. Maybe this guy is more suited to right wing than right forward, and Andre Schuller is more suited to left forward than left wing. And that may be the case, because I've heard quite good things about Bellarabi. But me personally, I just didn't find him that good. He's quick, his work rates are perfect, he's got 4 star skill moves, but I don't know what it was about him. He just couldn't finish at all. He got past two or three players and then put it wide or put it over or just something happened that stopped me scoring a goal. It was so, so frustrating that this guy was getting in really good positions but he just couldn't put it in the back of the net. Unlike Andre Schuller, who was always on it, man. He was banging in the goals no problem and Bellarabi was in Schuller's shadow for most of the time I played with him. But I imagine this guy would play better in a right wing position because he's more of a winger than a central player. I'd give these guys a solid 8 out of 10, mainly because because Andre Schuller is such a tank. If Bellarabi played a little bit better for me, I'd probably give them a 9, but he kind of held this partnership down, so I'm going to give him an 8 out of 10. But anyway guys, thank you for watching, like, comment and subscribe for more.